You go into a store, you see all the supplements. There's vitamin C, vitamin D, B12, B6. What in the world should we be taking? So I'm gonna ask you, vitamin supplements in general, good or bad? A lot of goods, but a few bads. All right, I'm gonna ask you, you're, you're holding up the back card. What's your name? My name is Tasha. Okay, Tasha, why bad? I would say it's bad because it's too many out there. There's vitamin A, vitamin B, vitamin C, vitamin D. That's why I don't take vitamins, because I don't know what to take. You don't know what to take. Now, everyone else seemed to put up the good card. So let me ask you at the end of the other, why, why do you think that, that vitamins are good for you? Because I don't think when you eat necessarily, you get all that you need, vitamin-wise. Do you take vitamins? Yes. Over half of Americans take vitamins and very regularly, and many take multiple vitamins at one time. But what if I told you there was a study, 39,000 women were followed in this study over the average of 19 years. They found a small increase in risk of death among older women who took supplements. The takeaway here is this. The takeaway is not that vitamins or supplements are bad for you. The takeaway is that indiscriminate use of them may actually decrease your life. What this study shows is not that vitamins are bad, but if you're gonna take a vitamin, I would clear it with your physician. And what's so interesting is a lot of us take multivitamins. In this study, women who took a multivitamin actually had a 2.4% higher risk of early death as compared to women who didn't. And again, that doesn't mean a multivitamin is bad for you. I just beseech everyone out there to not indiscriminately use vitamin supplements, discuss it with your doc, make sure you're on the vitamin supplements that you need to be on. We should get our nutrients from food.